Today in Ari's America, we welcome creator Candy Marlene Esparza. She's an Olympian, she won a medal, she's a badass boxer, and guess what else? Golden boy, she's the only girl on the ticket. My name is Marlene Esparza. I'm a female boxer. I love what I do and I love who I am. I like to fight, I want to fight, and I don't think necessarily it's just about fighting in the ring. I like to fight against what people think is the way I should be. Sometimes they're right, sometimes I am what they think I am. And a lot of times I'm not. When I was 16, 17 years old, I had won my first national title. And it was a big deal because no one in Texas had ever done it in that area during that time. And nobody in my gym had ever done it. And no one in my local gym had ever done it. And I was the first and I was a female and there wasn't a lot of girl boxers around. So it was like the first time that I was supposed to be getting a lot of respect, and I did. But one of the best fighters that we had in the gym, his father decided to walk up to me on the best day of my life and ask me why was I boxing because I was just gonna get pregnant anyway. It was so hurtful to me at the time that I didn't even know what to say. Now I would say a lot, but back then I was stuck. And I went home and I cried. I think he kind of tested my my faith towards what I was doing because he maybe said something that underlyingly I didn't want to say to myself because things like that could happen. I think that's what he struck was that failure is possible. It really wasn't about what he said. So it took me about four hours to figure out that whether I cry in the room or not, I'm gonna have to do what I want anyway because tomorrow morning, I'm still gonna wanna wake up and box. Sometimes you have to tell your emotions what to do. You can't just like let your emotions tell you where to go. My reality today is I have tons of respect from male and female athletes in and outside of boxing. I am one of the most sponsored athletes in the history of boxing. And that's not about money. I didn't mention that because oh, I'm sponsored so I have money. This is about the fact that not only did I, did I push so hard and work so hard that my peers believe in me, but I worked so hard that I got the outside world to believe in me. What I saw when I was 11 years old, it became even more than that, more than I could see. And along with it, other people saw it with me. 15 years ago, everybody thought I was insane. I had no future, I would never make money, I would never be successful and I would end up just going back to square one. Obviously, that is a complete lie. I've been ranked number one in the country for 10 years. I'm the first female to ever qualify for the Olympic Games. I'm the first female to ever medal in the Olympic Games. I'm the only Latin to make it on the podium in any of the weight classes and the first Olympic Games for women's boxing. I've won a lot of fights. I've, I have over 120 fights and over 100 wins. The majority of the girls that I fought were better than me. I wasn't the fastest, I wasn't the strongest, I wasn't always the smartest, but they didn't know it. So they didn't win. <laughs>